Emily and I are in Christ Church Cathedral. I always love the stained glass windows. Good morning and welcome visitors to Christ Church Cathedral. Ladies and gentlemen, may I have your attention please? Beginning at 10 minutes past 12, we have a guided tour of the cathedral, the crypt, the king's treasury, and the belfry. Tickets priced at four euro are available at the welcome desk where you enter the building. That's a guided tour of the cathedral, the crypt, the king's treasury, and the belfry. Beginning at 10 past 12. Thank you. Was from the yolk of an egg. History stuff. I'm glad I'm with someone who knows their stuff. you. Okay, welcome to, have a seat folks, make yourselves at home. We're in a secret room. Nineteen ropes, nineteen bells. That's what they look like, folks. Pearl bells rung full circle. For the type of bell we have and the way we ring them, this constitutes a world record. Defeating the old record back in 1999, when we had seven added for the upcoming Millennium Celebration. The oldest existing bell is at the end of this light blue rope here, 1738. Legend has it that particular bell was made from the remnants of cannon from the Spanish Armada. Famously sank off the west coast of Ireland, 1588. But as the Irish will tell you, just be careful of the Irish and their legends. Isn't that right? Yes, yes. The heaviest bell, Big Berta, heavyweight champion in the red corner, coming in at two and a quarter tons. Indeed, just shy of two tons is that red rope there. That, when it was being hoisted into position, 1851, slipped it shot, broke free, went careering back down to the ground. You guessed it, man was standing there. Mmm, ouch. Yeah. Safely say uh, his face rang up. Oh. <laughs> Rapidly along before my big mouth gets me sacked. There we go. We have a Simon and Garfunkel fan here, the sounds of silence. There we go, there we go, that's the spirit. Oh, Dublin just loves you guys. That is music to my ears. Maybe not. 
<laughs> 500 people en route to the main door now for a service that ain't going to happen. There you go, sir. Whoa. You're a feisty bunch this morning. There we go. Have a go, sir. By all means, have a go. Just shorten the stroke, sir. Shorten the stroke. Uh, if you uh, pull it too, too strong, then you're, you're all right. swinging the clapper away from the bell. You really are left with the sounds of silence. Just and meet it all the way back up. There we go. There we go. There you go, sir. There we go. Not really wrong. Charles the first and Charles the second, right? We so I was too involved with what he was saying to or what the statue here what he was saying. Alright, I found what I want my next dining set to look like. Cat and the Rat. Mummified rat and cat found in an organ donated to Christchurch Cathedral. You can still see its whiskers. Whiskers? Mummified whiskers? Not very happy looking. History. It's crazy. Yummy. <laughs> Yummy. All right. Just got back from Christchurch Cathedral, and it's raining outside for a change here in Dublin. Big surprise there. Next stop, Dublin. Asshole. Yeah, it doesn't look a whole lot like a castle, except for that little part up there. I feel like this is where they filmed part of this is Schloss. Never seen that movie. Why doesn't it look like much of a castle? Tell me! Well, the neoclassical architecture would suggest that it was built more in the 1700s. Um, you can see the arches that are around here actually in America. Um, not called the same thing, but the big triangular. I can't remember the name for them right now. But see the trims around the windows and the rounded archways and the, the columns. And there you have it. Which is a tribute to early Italian architecture. That was Italian. And it appears, so it's not the kind of castle I thought it would be. More medieval and like wartime like. That seems to be more of a castle for fanciness. <laughs> Accurate statement. This would be more of a castle of fanciness rather than medieval war times. Who oh, that good looking guy? Mm. 
you know. We thought we went all, through all that trouble of graduating college so we could get away from colleges. Now we're sightseeing them. So what does it mean when we visited? Uh, that was mostly to watch football. Did they, did they play football here? I think they play the wrong kind of football. We're looking for the library. Next up, we are here at Trinity College. Emily wants to go to the library, of course. What's wrong with Don't that? they play rugby or something? Can know. we see a rugby game? Sure. Book of Cups. The Guinness logo is here. Shot up the nostrils there. <laughs> <laughs> 